Hello everybody on YouTube, this is Super Nintendo, and welcome back to another episode of The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Last time, we, okay, we got like two side quests, and, or we got one side quest, and we completed another. We informed the boss of our triumph over the Divine Beast Bob Rudania. This time, we are going to complete Sheikah Shrines. We also helped a brother with his gullet problem. Oh, and here's another uh, iron sledgehammer in case you need another one. This place is chock full of them. And the Gorons are missing. We gotta inform the boss of the Goron Napper. Greedy Hill! This is my type of level. <laughs> Holy shit! Well, oh, ow! No, 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 no! Ow! Ooh, money! I saw money! No! No, no, no! Money, 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 money. Shit. I don't know if the money here respawns or not. Something tells me it's no. Cool, we got bomb arrows that we can't use because we're in Death Mountain. And there is a hole over here. With another treasure chest. With a ruby! Alright, we're already done with this one. Not too bad. It's not too late. There we go. Don't worry, we're gonna get another Goron massage before uh, we are done with this place. Can't help but feel like you belong here. Oh, cool, we found another guy who has two rings. Or, no, you have three rings. Damn it, that makes eight rings in hand. Now my joke doesn't work. Dulled Flight. Okay. Uh, real quick, I want to bring attention to these little lights here. I just want you to kind of see these because uh, some point in the future, we're going to have to deal with those by, you know, proxy. I thought for a second I was going to land on the, um, like, in the middle of that, and I was going to get crushed. Cool, silver rupee. Always need more money. I'm a greedy son bitch. Also, I'm American, so <laughs> that answers that. <laughs> uh, does that count as racism? Like, am I racist to my own guy? <laughs>
Blue Flame. I think I know which one this is. I think. I'm not, I'm not entirely sure. Maybe. Hey look, here's these sliding metallic puzzles that everybody seems to hate for some reason. No! <laughs> That's what I get. That's what I get for making fun of people. <laughs> sworn we had one that like there was somebody who wanted like royal weaponry or something maybe I forgot to get it on my uh when I was having to redo stuff there's a capture card complications alright we still have a torch so uh uh, just like every other, uh, thing that can hold fire, fire does harm your torch. Eventually. But, you know, it's not as big of a thing. Yes. I didn't know if you could do that or not. I don't, I don't remember ever having to do that. Let's take this fire. And... Wait for the torch. I did it wrong! No! Come back here! No! I will shoot you! Shoot you with this fire arrow that you crave! I'm a fucking weirdo. <laughs> okay, I don't. Huh? Okay. I have suddenly turned into William Shatner. <laughs> Every so often, just stuff happens in this game that you- Ah, oh my god! Every so often, stuff happens in this game that you just kind of are like, Okay. I don't know how that counted, but... Okay. You will die! Oh, just something to be noted, you can't use guardian powers in, uh, shrines. Uh, so no Revali's Gale, no, um, no Daruk's Protection, none of that. You know, that's just something to make note of. I don't think I ever verbally acknowledged it before because, ooh, giant ancient core. Uh, 
because like is the situation to use uh, Ravali's Gale. Great flame blade. That is a very good weapon. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Let's get rid of the Dragon Bobo Club. Whee! It's just a sword, like a, a reskin sword, so it doesn't matter. But the Great Flame Blade. Okay, so the Great Flame Blade is actually a um, a renewable item, meaning you can easily find it in the wild. There is a place very, not close by to where we are right now, but close by uh, to one of the Sheikah Towers that you can get a renewing great uh, flame blade with um, you know Okay, so what you want to do here is shoot you and shoot you. Alternatively, if you have a bow that shoots three arrows at a time, you can just shoot it like that. But that's an alternative way. And we here at Super Nintendo Industries don't do alternatives. There is no alternative for stupidity. <laughs> only, only low quality entertainment here. <laughs> I'm terrible. For multiple reasons, of course. Uh, shit. Kerpopi! Kersh Blody. Okay, so let's stop you and metallicize you all the way over there. Back to your regularly metallitized program. I am. I'm just laughing at my own stupidity at this point. Was I ever not doing that? Who the fuck knows? No, 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 no! Shit. <laughs> my butt's on fire. Oh, cool, it moved over. Express elevator going up. All right, let's go kill those guys with the good old walloping of hammer. Oh wait, 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 wait. Okay, I thought I was gonna get all three of you, but apparently not, and you get to die. Ow, my face. That's my face, sir. Uh, I think there's another guardian over here. I might be mistaken. No, I am not. But there's a treasure chest. Ooh, beautiful treasure chest. I love me some treasure chests. This is the longest Sheikah shrine we've had in a while. Damn. I just gotta leave. I hope you guys are enjoying the series because, uh, like, this is, like I said, in the. Ooh, treasure chest. Gimme, 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 gimme. But, uh, I hope you guys are enjoying this series because this is. Forest Dweller Sword. Uh. Yeah, we'll toss the Great Flame Blade because, like I said, this is a renewable item. We can get another one. I lit it on fire! This is a wooden sword. Um, it's really cool looking. I like it a lot. Uh, the Forest Dweller Sword is a very rare item. 
you're not likely to get another one very often. So, you know, if you're the type of player that likes to hoard his items because they are rare, well, now you know one. And scoop up me! Skadoosh! Does that sound like like a gay dinosaur there for a second? Skadoosh! That sounds like a cowardly lion. <laughs> oh, I don't know about this, George. I don't even know what voice I'm doing. Metal makes a path. Oh, does it now? Mocha. I was gonna laugh if I ran in ran there with the with the uh boulder heading our way. We could make that no problem. Crap! <laughs> like, like I said, only, only the lowest quality content here at Super Nintendo. <laughs> oh my god, that was funny. That was that was funny. I don't care who the fuck you are. That was funny shit. Uh. Get out of my life! Alright, that was the only uh, treasure chest in here, so let's progress. Shall we? You know, with the, uh, the metal orb here, like, glowing gold because of our stasis ruin, it kind of reminds me of the map orb from uh, Treasure Planet. Like, anybody else watch that movie? I love that movie. It's really good. Ah! The boy! Balls of disaster. Here you go, shit. Here you go, uh, monk dude. All the balls you could ever do stuff with. I will let judge. <laughs> oh my god, look at his head. It's, it's like they do. <laughs> it's like they do. Okay. With all of that under our belt, I think we are done for this episode. Next time on The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, we actually are not going to head off. I just noticed all those birds there. They're circling around something. It's like they're taunting me. They know a secret. I know it. But anyway, they, uh... Anyway, the next time, we actually are not going to go after the next dungeon. What we are going to do is head off and try to find this, this uh, sword that seals the darkness that everyone keeps mentioning. Alright, see you guys then.